Hey y'all. <clears throat> so, um, as you know, I just started dating someone, and that always gets my wheels turning about future, my parents, all sorts of things. Um, but today I want to talk about my parents. Because, man, sometimes I just feel like I shouldn't talk about them, but the reality is that I, I want to talk about some of the ways I feel about uh, my relationship with them, and I want to preface all of this by saying I love my parents. I do. I love my parents. They love me. That will never change. And in some sense, someone always wishes their parents were different or better or whatnot than they are. You know, everyone feels that way. Not just me. Um, anyway, I kind of got down the rabbit hole of YouTube today. Watching, like, some wedding videos, showed my suggestions, I was watching a different trans YouTuber talk about his, like, proposal story, so then it was in the, you know, the autoplay auto next thing, and I just got into the rabbit hole of watching some videos, and in a couple of videos, um, the, the mothers talked about how they've been praying for their child's spouse since their child was born. Which is a, a common a thing that my parents have said before and that people that went to our church talked about that they've been praying for so-and-so's spouse that they would find that person. And I think that's very interesting. And it, it, it makes me curious because, you know, do my parents just pray for my spouse genderlessly? Did they pray for my spouse as a... As a my husband, because I was a woman. How do they pray about my spouse now? Do they even pray about my spouse now? Do they care? Um, have a really hard time sometimes. Because I feel like my relationship with them is just, it's only ever surface level. Um, you know, I don't, I don't feel like it's going to ever be a deep relationship, and I'm trying really, really, really hard to form a relationship with them going forward and forget about everything that's happened before, because I could, I could just be angry and hurt by them for the rest of my life, or I could choose to move forward and, you know, work on the relationship that we have now, and then I just get down these rabbit holes of thoughts of like, you know, are they even going to go to my wedding? Are they going to care? Or do they want to meet my girlfriend? Are they, you know, like, just on and on and on. I mean, they're meeting her tomorrow because they're helping my sister move, so they don't really have a choice on that. But are they going to want to make an effort? And is it going to be the same type of excitement that they felt when my sister met Micah and they really liked Micah? Are they going to be like, wow, we really like her, we're really happy for you, or are they just not going to talk about it? Um, yeah, I don't know. It's just all these things going on. Um, and I'm, I know this is not just a trans-related topic. This is like everyone experiences this kind of feeling. So I'm not trying to make it solely about, well, I'm trans and my parents, blah, blah, blah. You know, I'm just thinking out loud. I, did, I started to have these thoughts go, and I'm like, you know what? I'm going to talk about it. So just as I enter this new relationship and think about my future, I just wonder how it will go with them involved in those things. Like I, I talked about before around Christmas. Sorry, I'm so fidgety. I'm always fidgety. But like I talked about around Christmas, how, how my parents have talked about moving closer to wherever my sister ends up so that when she has kids and all that, and it's like, you know, how does, how does that kind of impact? You know, what about me? What, if, what about when I want to have kids? Stuff like that. Um, this is the same kind of thing. Not about kids, but about, about weddings. Are they going to go? Are they going to help me pay? Are they going to be excited? These are all thoughts I've been having for a while because my sister's getting married. So I just, you know, you start thinking about, well, what's my wedding going to be like? Because <sighs> obviously some part of me just, just, you know, wants so badly to, for them to be there and to be part of more of my life. Where, like, you know, I, I got business cards recently. I wish I could get excited and go, hey, mom, here's my business card. But they don't want it. 
At least I assume that they don't want it because they don't want me to be trans, so. And, you know, everything I did with the house bill. Are they proud of me? I don't know. I was in the newspaper a lot of times. Are those newspaper clippings hanging on the fridge? No. Hanging on my fridge. I don't know. I just have this wonder. Because, you know, I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm doing a lot. And I don't want my career to maybe turn into talking about my transition. So how, you know, are they going to be proud of me as a grown-up for what I'm doing when they think that just my existence is not right? This is what has kept me away from church for so long. These kind of thoughts. Because, um, you know, they pray for my spouse. I pray for my spouse. But, you know. <laughs> anyway, it's getting, it's getting a little too complicated to explain to you what's going on in my head. So, um, Anyway, I've talked for probably way too long. Hey, babies. The babies are wrestling. Um, I feel like I'm all over the place because I am all over the place. Anyway, uh, hope you guys stay. Hope you guys are having a great week, and I'll talk to you next time.